It was a nightmare. Getting multiple 911 calls, a child being attacked by some sort of animal. Fifteen horrified witnesses could only watch helplessly as two pit bulls mauled a seven-year-old boy to death. Apparently the dog will not let go of the child. It happened in Lowell, Massachusetts, outside Boston. Shots fired. The dog said it's still coming at me. Oh, well, the dog just jumped over the fence. The dog's gone. My paramedic step it off. Do you have a description of this animal? Well, it looks like a brown pit bull. One witness says the little boy reached over the fence to pet the dogs and was pulled into the yard by the pit bulls. Neighbors heard his screams. They also saw his mother yelling, it's my baby. 15 people reportedly stood there unable to stop the vicious mauling. Two pit bulls ganging up on a victim can be terrifying. This video was shot in New York City when a 62-year-old man was attacked after reportedly trying to pet them. Even the dog's owner was powerless. One witness used a water hose, but they still came after him. So is there anything you can do if you see someone being attacked by a dog? Should you A, scream and yell at the dog, B, punch and kick the dog, or C, try to force something in the dog's mouth and haul it off? You have seconds, not minutes, you have seconds. Robert Brandau of K9 Companions in New Jersey is a state certified animal control officer. He says the answer is C, get something in the dog's mouth. So like my shoe. A shoe, exactly. So, so we take this shoe and I kind of come in sideways and I'm trying to get that shoe in the dog's mouth and get the dog interested in the shoe. So now I've got the dog biting something else. Now I'm going to grab the dog off. I'm, since it's on the shoe, I'm going to pull the dog away from the victim. The dog will not let go of the child.